The prospect of a new dinosaur discovery has brought Mike, Julie, and Mark to Ghost Ranch to see for themselves. Yeah, here's the lower leg bone. Here's the other one. Uh -huh. This is the fibula, tibia, and the other tibia. And part of the pelvis is coming out here. Right, so the skeleton is sort of smeared across this direction. And part of the femora. This area is a little bit... The wider. number of fossils here is staggering. Over. Layers and layers of animals are piled up in this mass burial place, which seems to have been a sharp bend in an ancient riverbed. What happened here? The high desert landscape is dramatic, and so are the torrential rain squalls that can turn dry canyons into raging rivers of death, as they must have done back in the age of dinosaurs. In Arizona's Petrified Forest National Park, 200 million year old fossilized trees are reappearing as the ground erodes around them, evidence of the ancient floods that violently uprooted and buried them. Though now extinct, these giant trees of the Triassic were similar to the Pacific redwoods of today. But it wasn't just trees that got swept up in ancient floods. Early dinosaurs like Coelophysis were always on the defensive. They lived in a world still dominated by larger reptiles, like this 1,500 pound Postosuchus. Floods washed the drowned bodies of reptiles and dinosaurs into concentrated deposits. Perhaps this is why Sterling and team are finding so many in one area. When they locate a skeleton, they carefully excavate around it, then cover it up with a jacket made of plaster and toilet paper, which always comes in handy out in the field. This protects the fossils so that they can be transported to the lab where the bones will be delicately separated from the rock. This summer's dig at Ghost Ranch has been productive beyond our greatest expectations. We found something really exciting, and we think it may be a new dinosaur. Uh, all right, get ready. Switch. I'm okay, I'm, I'm... It's thrilling to find a dinosaur we've never known before that hasn't seen the light of day for over 200 million years. It will take many months to determine what it looked like and how important it is, but it will surely change our views of how dinosaurs rose to dominance. Oh, excellent. Preservation looks really nice. It's preparing very nicely in this area. <laughs> 